Here, here we're doing an air leak test on 1953 Alcourt Sunfish uh, Zip. We've identified a few places along this uh, seam that's between the deck edge and the aside. We're also checking the the hull to the aside seam. That's been holding up pretty well, but we're finding quite a few areas of blue tape marks where we've got some bubbles coming out. So what we do is we mark an area however far it's bubbling and a little bit of tape on either side. We're going to come back and just uh, trim out just a little bit of the uh, sealant that's in there and then uh, inject in some new sealant. What we're doing is taking the shop back. It's got some low pressure air. The volume's about medium. A boat like this, we're not worried about uh, there's no foam blocks inside to uh, dislocate or anything like that. So we we taped up the uh, the holes on the uh, cockpit wall. We have already done the bow section. Now we're back doing the stern section, taped over the holes, the little uh, limber holes. Got the hose going in there, so we're gonna start this vacuum up. We get loud, and then we'll spray, and you'll see where the little bubbles coming out. It means there's a uh, or air coming out, causing bubbles with the uh, soapy uh, water mix of Dawn dishwashing liquid and uh, water. So here we go. So what I'll do now is I'll take uh, tape and I'll mark just a little section here because it's only one small spot. Probably a little bit bigger section here. I'd like to say just go in there and ease out that. Uh... See, sometimes you can actually even see the, the little gap, the little void. And so when I said I didn't expect to find many issues after I put that little piece of rub rail on I was I was wrong so we're gonna go ahead and finish up mark those areas get um, use our oscillating multi-tool to just uh, clean out a little bit of the old sealant it's probably a resource and all glue and then inject in uh, total boat Dixo wood and that's what we've done on other boats, uh, fiberglass boats. And that's also what we did on Winnie. And that took care of the issues there. We also found uh, one small leak down in the uh, dagger board trunk. Aft side, not surprisingly, probably where the boards come up and you know run into something, hit the bottom aft side of the trunk a few times. So what we'll do is We'll get the boat, uh, when we flip it over to check the uh, keel beam or the keel seams along the plywood edge there, we'll just take some uh, Thixo, put it on a little paint stick and just go up inside with the paint stick and work it uh, back and forth in those corners at least halfway up. And that's usually, um, once again, that's, that's what's worked on other boats. So this is the 1953 Alcourt 
sunfish uh, zip out here enjoying the nice Florida sunshine and getting a little uh, Dawn dishwashing uh, liquid bath and we'll get her all fixed up. <laughs> 